All right, here is Basement FX, The Howler. I was thinking about getting a mask from Basement FX and I thought this Howler one was a perfect one to pick up. I'm glad I did. It's a good company, good people. Um, fantastic mask. Uh, I was doing some research trying to find some good close-up pictures of this mask before I bought it and really couldn't find any, so I thought I'd do that here. Um, basement effects, like I said, this is the paint up of the gray spotted, which I thought was the coolest color. I mean, the brown werewolf, I think they have too, is fantastic, but I just like the gray spotted. The detail on this thing is fantastic. I wanted to add a werewolf to the collection of masks, and I thought this one would be perfect. I ordered it without hair, which I'm going to add hair real soon to it. They said I can send it back to add the hair when I'm ready. So that's that's the plan. But I'll tell you what, this thing is detailed to the max. Nice thickness. This one's real tight getting on, but when it's on, it feels fantastic. So. What are you doing? But here it is, the gums, the teeth, I mean, everything's awesome. Well, um, sending it back in probably a month or two to get the hair put on it. I wanted to get it first without the hair to see how I liked it before I wanted to spend the extra money on the hair. I believe it's, I think you can get it done for like three to six hundred more dollars so, for the hair. So, do you want to review it? Yeah. Okay, what do you think of this? Good. Good? Yeah. You think it's awesome? Yeah. Is it one of your favorites? Yes. All right. All right, guys. Well, that's a that's a quick review and a close up of the mask. Yeah, this is a little squishy guy, but these teeth. Yeah. All right. Say bye. Bye.